Hi, I'm Justin Pepper, Head Recruitment Director here at Beta Sigma Psi Ada Chapter. Today I'm going to be showing you a little bit of our house tour and the inside of the newly renovated Ada house. Working our way inside of the house, this is our great room, this is our main formal room. Guys come here to play pool before dinner and just chill out. These are cudgels, these are our main ones in the, in the great room. We make these during St. Pat's to compete with other fraternities. To my right here, we have a smaller meeting room used for IFC meetings and rush interviews. To my left, we have a larger study room. What I really like to do when I come in here to study, I pull up uh, problems on the TV and do them on the whiteboard from our file system. Making our way into the new addition here, this is the line that separates the old and the new. New renovation was $1.5 million, and thanks to our many generous donors and alumni, we were able to raise that pretty quickly. Down this hallway, we got our chapter room. This is our biggest room in the house for meetings, such as chapter meetings, e-board meetings, and judicial board meetings. Here at Beta Sig, we go by three S's, spiritual, scholastic, and social. And thanks to our academic program, we're able to keep a lean focus on Scholastic. With our program, we were able to get third GPA out of all fraternities on campus. As part of the new addition, we added a complete new deck on. And so people like to come up here to hang out. On a second floor, each floor, second and third, has one of these lounge areas with a drinking fountain and a TV connected to the Hulu and Netflix. Currently we're in the existing edition. This is our two man narrow style rooms right now. These rooms are great for having a great little movie set up, futon and a couch, put them side by side and have two desks across the wall. And we got Archie on the bed over here. This is our house dog. He belongs to Dylan Falter, remember here. Coming in here, we got a Jack and Jill style room. This is a lounge area with TV and futon to hang out with the boys occasionally. Working our way back here, we have beds, desks, and closets. This is the only room in the house that doesn't have the sleep and study separate from each other, but that is an alternative to give you a nice little living room space in the other room. This is my room on third floor. This is a, a very unique style room because we have sleep separate from the study. So if your buddy wants to study at night, you can go to sleep without disturbing him. We got closets over here. And what I did with my room was I had a little TV set up here with a futon and I was able to keep my desk set up here. Personally, this is my favorite part of the new addition. This is our new built-in shop. Here we take part in all kinds of recreational building. And here we also take part in St. Pat's building our new float that we took first place in last year and overall first place in St. Pat's. Our alumni were very generous in donating mo most of the tools in this shop. No other fraternity has anything to the scale of what we have at Beta Sig. We, along with this is a huge safety concern though. That's why we invested in an industrial size saw stop, five horsepower, 208 voltage. We take safety here very seriously, that's why we have a shop committee dedicated to training individuals in shop safety and shop training. This is one of two smaller study rooms in the house. We have one on third floor and one on second. People like to come in here to get homework done with small groups and they can also take advantage of the file system which is approved by campus. This has old tests and quizzes and homework assignments for people to look off of to prepare for upcoming tests. At Beta Sig, we have three laundry rooms. This is the one on third floor, similar to second. We have two dryers, two washers. This accommodates everybody for no additional cost, as long as you bring your own detergent and clothes, of course. This is one of our two-man rooms. This is personally my favorite two-man room just because of the amount of space and flexibility you have with certain furniture and desks in here. You have bunks and closets in the back, and then you have the option to put a futon or a couch in here as well. Included in the cost of Beta Sig living in house is a meal plan Monday through Friday. Our chef Lizzie, she's great. She cooks meals for us. 
lunch and dinner, and then on the weekends we cook meals for ourselves for the house. And we do have continental breakfast if you'd like that, eggs, cereal, milk, fruit, it's all provided. We also have leftovers, 24 seven access to the kitchen, and you can get food whenever you want. You should never go hungry at Beta City. This is our biggest study in the room in the house. We got some whiteboards here, big tables for large group studies, such as a trig review session before every orientation day here at Missouri S&T. Got our printers over here. This is kind of unlimited printing for everybody. Campus restricts us to 500, but here it's free at no additional cost. Right now you're in one of the traditional three men rooms. Living here to my right is President Henry Scooby. Hey, I'm Henry Scobie. I'm the president of Ada Chapter of Beta Sigma Psi, and ever since our establishment in 1952, Ada Chapter has been building gentlemen of conviction and character. Feel free to look around my room. So you just gotten done with the house tour from Justin, but trust me, there's way more to Beta Sig than just the house. If you have questions about Beta Sigma Psi or Greek life in general, please contact me. My information's below. And also we have house tours and rush events going on all year long, so feel free to reach out.